So, and welcome back to the video. So in this video, I'm going to show you the NCAA Women's Basketball Conferences. I have announced their conference tournament schedule. There was nine of them that I announced. Two, and then we're finished playing yesterday, the final games. Yesterday, um, it was the MAAC. The Missouri Valley Conference. We have the Big 12, the Big West, the Colonial Athletic Conference USA. We had Big the Missouri Valley, MVC, the AAC, Big 12. Big West Conference you see Colonial Athletic I believe If I was IV six is an AAC Yes Oh, and nine was the map. Yep. So it was right. Okay, there were nine conferences, but then the map. But then there's the Missouri Valley. And the Missouri Valley and the map. Okay. Now, so there's first, then last night, the MAC. The Colonial Athletic in the Big 12 announced theirs. Now the Big West Conference USA and the SWAC announced their conference tournaments. The Ivy has not announced their conference tournaments yet. But I presume they will announce theirs like Monday, maybe? I'm not sure. So on the seventh we have the Big West quarter, the Big West first round. Bakersfield against CSU Bakersfield against CSU Northridge is mm, the seventh at New Pacific is being played in I believe Las Vegas. Yeah. I know Henderson that that now, but near Las Vegas. And then that's that new bits of any stream plus and then at two three stream or two three Pacific. So you're saying carefully any stream plus. And then we have the sweat quarter, the sweat did it, the women's quarter is first, then they do a men's quarter, then they do a women's quarter, then they do a men's quarter. But, yeah, as it remains, I'm playing left again, I'm going to eat it. And so I'm going to eat, maybe it's a sweat tournament. On, yep, yeah, it's being plus set, new knees for This is like the 4 or 5 match of the No, oh, it's the three sets. It's two seven. I'm not sure. So it's been shot. And then we have the coverage. You see what they do is. Unless it's like the first round, but for like the other rounds, they have multiple games. They do like the women's quarters at night. The women's first. Then they do the men's, but they have two courts. So court A and court B. What they used to do was they used to show one court on ESPN Plus, and one court would be on like watch team. Huh? 
and like the Stadium, which and their Steam channel, which simulcast did like, which is a large Steam channel, and then which simulcast did, I believe certain games or had produced for volleyball sports like Conference USA games, it would air on the network, on like region networks, the volley region networks, and Steam channel. And they would show one of them on there. Then for the men's, they would have both on there. And you could watch one on, maybe one on the extra channel, one on the main channel. In a local region network. So maybe it's just one on streaming, one on the region network. One on the region networks. And you can watch both on streaming if you two. But that's how they do it. And then they would show one in full. And then they would go to the other court, you know. And that's not as interesting, maybe. Because it, it would start like 30 minutes after. So you'd see the ending of that one. They didn't intend to change, I think. But anyways. But, yeah, they do it the same site, two quarters. Which is kind of interesting. But I think it's so teams can't get right. You can't get rid of the engine in your team. You know that you're... You know that you're... Like, you know, seeing them getting like a scouting event. Which is fair, you know. But at New East, as uh, at New Eastern Eleven Center, because in Texas, uh, Fort Star, you have Charlotte and Lafayette at New Eastern Eleven Center, and then at two thirty Eastern One Thirty Central, you be in North Texas, and then that is at two East. At 3 p.m. Eastern 2 Central, we have FAU and UTSA. And then we have also for the New Pacific, we have TVUC right in the Midwest corner. And UC San Bernardino and UC Davis at 2.30 Pacific. And then we have at and six Pacific, we have TV in Long Beach City. That's the two ma- the two C matchup. And that's the four or five. And you see Rangers on one. And then four to nine, the three six matchup. That's at 30 p.m. East Pacific. 6 30 Hawaii 10. And then we have. Some of these are the semis, or no, I for other conferences, but I'm not talking about them, I'm talking just like the regular matchups, or the finals, or the, you know, to be turn games. And there's just so weird that the Ivy still has announced there is. Even when our season is already even done. But we have a new Eastern 11 Central, we have TV in number 24 M. Yes, we went to CC. You had two low flaws in conference, but but then they bounced back. Then they had some soul, you know, but they bounced back pretty well. You know, afterwards. That 11 Central New Eastern Eastern Plus, the CUC court. First set course, set course, the third set course. I think we could make out on the seat. I think we could make like out of it. This conference. It's true, but they snuck in after the Bethune ones were not, they were even having a chance to be the auto bid for the NI, the WNIT, but <laughs> that was not the case, no more. That was a bunch of tiebreakers that get the automatic, that determine the WNIT qualifier, so. So who was going to be that, who was going to be the two or the two seed in that sweat turn? Wow. And that's it. Noon Eastern. And then that 12.30 a.m. 12.30 p.m. Eastern, 11.30 Central. Is you tip in the museum tip. And that 2.30 Eastern, 11.30 Central. Is TV West Kentucky. And it is TV Rights. At 3 Eastern. 2 Central. 
and we have the fourth and final set core, pretty good summer. That's a sweet score. And this is the way we know. Men play the same way as the court. Big what? Flex and drink. What do you get? Ministry. And then what do we play at? Six series. And then for the um, big west series, we'll get. Three Union Pacific and four thirty Pacific or two thirty Pacific. And for the CUSA semis, that is the men. CUSA plays first, just for the semis because it is in CBS Sports Network. More for the TV purpose. Then the women will play in ESPN Plus at five thirty Eastern, four thirty Central. And seven, Eastern, Seven Central. And then we have the IV set. So we're not going to use that. Fourth Eastern and Seven Eastern. And then it is going to be the set final at. Set final at. One. At two Eastern and Eastern Plus. And then we have. Yeah, we can find on ESPN News and ESPN Plus at 5 Eastern, at 4, 5.30 East, 4.30 Central. This is USA Women's Final and CBS Sports Network. And then there will be the West Final. We are at 6 East, we are at 3 Pacific on ESPN Plus. So there you have it. So one man eighty ounces their TV time well their time three ounces but when the matchups are noticed in the Ivy League I'll let you know even though it's Princeton or it's Columbia the one Princeton said to Harvard's the three and Penn's the four I presume presumably that'd be the case but. I haven't officially announced it yet. Who's gonna play when? Who's gonna play first? Is it gonna be the four match? Or is it gonna be the one for our first? Or is it gonna be two, three first? Who knows? So, when that gets fair, I'll let you know.